Old goats. Sunday's midline workout. Uh, we're going to get a little bit more into our hip flexors again. Uh, most of these moves that you've done before pretty similar to one of our previous workouts. Cool. So, let's do it. Starting off with, we're going to get into that straddle position. Legs as wide as we can. Turn into oval, leaning over one leg and raising that leg off the ground, keeping that leg nice and straight. Ooh, six reps on your left, six on your right. If that's too hard, we can get a plate. Sitting on the plate again, legs nice and wide, makes it a little bit easier to get that leg raised up. Okay, you might have to get a few plates, you might have to even get a box, whatever we can manage. It's a very difficult movement, okay, to try and get to start off with, okay? Six on your left, six on your right. Feet together, keeping that chest nice and tall as we push it towards our feet. And then bringing our feet up again for another six reps. Back up nice and wide again for another six reps together. Woo, my hip flexors. Cool, next movement we're going to do. A few different holds now. Going to get into a side plank so whether on your forearm or on your hand stay nice and tall make sure that we're not sagging that hip down to the ground or losing our balance okay keep everything nice and straight from shoulder hip feet cool 30 seconds on your left 30 seconds on your right 30 second hollow hold whatever hollow hold that we're able to manage um, whether it be just holding that hollow position there with feet and hands extended. Or well, if you can't do that, hands off to our side. You can raise one knee up, or the other knee, or both. Whatever we're able to manage for that 30 second hold, okay? Um, and then we're gonna roll through some vinyasas. Cool, so in that vinyasa flow, get yourself started in that push up position. Push your head through your arms, butt up nice and high. Dive down to your hands. Push up and then feed yourself through again to start in that pipe press position. Let's go. 